Member for Memorcook Tantramar. Mr. Speaker, we as a species have about 126 months to reduce emissions by 45% below 2010 levels. By the time we hear the next throne speech, we will have 121 months left. It's about 10 years. Imagine if we had leadership that was focused on energy efficiency and solar energy and worked on building a coalition of premiers to ramp up renewable energy jobs. One cannot claim to take the climate emergency seriously while flying around wearing pro-pipeline t-shirts and trying to make the case for fracking. Mr. Speaker, I would like the Premier to consider something I'm asking with sincerity. What if he is wrong on this? What if oil and gas development is the problem, not the solution? What if these decisions help lock in irreversible runaway climate breakdown? I would also ask the Premier to think about where he gets his information. Is he listening to oil and gas executives or to climate scientists? Because they are certainly going to tell him different things about what we should do. I'm going to trust the scientists. What will our Premier do?